Hey everybody, it's The Plague Lives again. I'm back with Life is Strange Episode 3. Uh, I'm going to continue where I left off from yesterday. Uh, if I remember, we were, leave we were going into the pools. Going into the pool. Did it? Are we going to the pool? Yeah, we are. Okay. We're good. Got scared for a minute. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. I think things are getting, uh... Chloe is so psyched for girls mm. night out, so I better follow her evil plan. And there's a world party. Hey, that's my birthday. Nope. Speak. Boys or girls? What? Does it matter? We'll stick with uh, girls, of course. Where I should go. Girls. Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Look. If only Lord. I could solve the mystery of the missing cat picks. Huh. Oh, okay. Oh, do I just go in there? Looky, looky. Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive in with Warren. Oh. Okay. Hello. Where does that other sock go? <laughs> okay. There's probably nothing. To oh, Victoria's locker. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your. No. Jefferson said don't confuse art with the artist. Okay. These are cool shots. Flippers in a swimming pool? Are they training Navy frogmen here? Kate's locker. A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? Hmm. Can't see much into that. I mean, I don't, like I said, I don't know if she ran away. I think, uh... I really actually think it's like the worst thing that's probably not good to think but I, I honestly do think she's probably dead I may be wrong though I want to say she's alive but I oh, screw you whoever wrote that well we care dickhead yeah dickhead <laughs> Okay. More graffiti, what does that say? No. What are you doing? Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. What? Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. Where's the light? Right here? No. In case I run out of air, I know where to come. Where is that light? Do we have to have the light on? Where am I now? Yeah, I'm in the men's locker room now, so it didn't even really matter. You could go and... I guess I should consider this evolution. You can go in either locker room, so. Nathan. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? I don't know. Zach is really careless. 
Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Okay. Lauren. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. Oh, an actual picture. Why? <laughs> Most of the pictures are like uh, kind of like drawn or uh, like art style, and that one was an actual screenshot or a uh, actual picture. That's funny. All right, let's see what we're doing here. Where's the light? Where's the light? I have no idea where I'm going. You know, I probably already passed by the light. Looks like I'm the Vortex Club bouncer. Decisions, decisions. Oh. Oh, for just one picture of their faces when they see my name. Okay, what can I remove? Oh, I'm sorry. Your names are not on the list. You'll have to eat shit now. I'm guessing I remove like. Can I look? Looks like I'm the vortex uh, club nope. bouncer. Okay. Decisions, decisions. Yeah, I know that's gonna have consequences. Whatever. No running near the pool. No, I'm doing it. Where's that freaking light switch? I've already passed it. I know. Where am I going? Oh, I'm not doing too hot right now. This is taking forever. Where's the light switch? Oh. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. Yep. My leg is stuck. <laughs> My pant leg got stuck. Well, that was quick. She didn't even bother like going into excuse me, going into the dressing room or anything. She's just like, nope. Anything I can look through in here? No. Okay. No, let's search. Yes, we get it. Otters. Okay. I was hoping to find something awesome. That wasn't too awesome. Alright, let's go. What are you doing? No, nope, wait. I wanted to talk. Time to do or dive, Max. Okay. What did I do? Speak. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. It feels like a hot tub. Too bad oh, you made I'm me feel it. like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not going to stand there watching me like a zombie. Oh boy. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. Can't show that. <laughs> Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 and I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. I always feel weird like when there's the childish <laughs> scenes in in uh, games like this, but I'll just rewind and harp. It is more connection. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> It's still a lot of cuts. I wish Rachel was one. here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. Are you worrying You're in becoming trouble? like. This force of nature. Something's More gonna like happen, you know. Nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Thank God. But what if I had? What if Kate didn't jump, but you would be... 
dead. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected, since without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. But no, he's but... really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. I don't like that. It's feel like Now I'm getting cold in here. See when you get connected to the they're Because getting more we're connected. yapping instead of attacking each other. Otter versus shark style. I uh think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. See, the closer you get to the characters, something's gonna happen, you know? Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Uh-oh. Yep, I knew it. Hide! I knew it. I knew it. Where'd she go? Let's go. Can we just get out? We have to go now. Make sure you cover the whole perimeter. Are you shitting me? What? Oh no. What's going on? Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. I could use my power, or just look for a hiding spot, or both. Where are they? Hello? I don't like this. Hello? Anybody there? I don't like this at all. I'm not good at hiding in games at all. Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Like this man. Go away. He's a scary man. We are so invisible. Let's bail. That was horrifying. I don't like that. I don't like hiding in video games. I'm not normally good at it. I don't even know where to go anyway. As we all saw there, I was just kind of just dodging and avoiding. I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do Wait, there. Turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. What is going on? How'd they even know I was there? Like You can't to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? <laughs> okay. Into the car! Get in! <laughs> Later, fuckers! Max, you rock! We are so fucking awesome! <laughs> yes, we so are. All the security cameras. No, no, there's no security cameras in the school yet. That's right. 
I don't know then. I don't know how they knew I, we were there or anything. Maybe I'm just completely forgetting something that happened yesterday. I don't know. As I said before, there's still a lot of cutscenes in this one. Not as much gameplay it's seeming like. I don't know. They're in bed together. This is. We're pushing toward an obvious uh, relationship with these, like, like closer than you think. Always remember this moment. Whose first thought in the morning is just let's take a picture of myself. Photo bomb. What the Photo heck? Ow. Something in my pocket just stabbed me. Ow. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. That's nice. Like it needs another one. There you go. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Yeah. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. Oh. Okay, I need to get dressed now. Let's see. Okay. Just not gonna respond. That's nice. So, so nice of me. Alright. It's, uh... I thought Chloe might put up a pic of me instead. Holy shit balls! Frank is scary. I should have let Chloe take that money. Oh, come on. No, you can't play that with me. Frank I'm might not... think twice about messing with Chloe now, but... If David finds yeah, you out... Hide that, dude. Shit storm. Ugh, still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Oh boy. I'm lucky David didn't bust me for acting like it was my pot. Oh, at least we haven't been identified. Yet. Vandalism. <laughs> a nude man with a sword. Yeah, no. I definitely man was started to be under the influence of energy drinks and <laughs> it's so weird. Thank God she's okay. I wonder when I can visit her. Vandalism though, what? Wow, sir. That was my tenth birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept this stuff. Alright. What's that? The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. Okay. Open. Okay. Let's see. Time for some Chloe cosplay. 
Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. Oh boy. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. <laughs> Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever Turns you want to try. Bit. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> oh, man. I think we're going to do it for the friendship. I don't know if it's going to go any farther than that because obviously if Max is obviously involved with Warren, I don't... I'll do it for the friendship. Like... Damn, you're hardcore, okay. Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> unless he's into girl-on-girl -girl action. You're such well, a then. dork. Okay. Oh, man. That was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. All right then. It's still going to get to that point though. I don't know. I, I it feels like it. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. It might just because I'm still kind of in the feel of like uh The Last of Us the DLC. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra. What? Maybe not. Yeah. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. <laughs> Free breakfast. I have to uh, wake and bake first. Ah. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Open. Wow. I remember this old phone. We decorated it together. I like snooping through things in this game. I don't know. All right, I think we're good to go, though. Not much else to sneak through. Oh my god. That smells so amazing. It's like... Okay. Glenn, we were kids here. That bird is still here. No way. That's the bluebird I saved Monday in Joyce's room. Now I'm interested. What's ironic is I always like the decisions in this game. That was such a small thing. Brush. Small decision in the game. And it's still here. Like this was in episode. This was last episode, right? Or it may have been the first episode. I'm not sure. I think it was last episode, though. So. Feels so good to wash my face after all that chlorine, and hiding. Photo. I'm gonna have to remember that though, like small decisions matter now. And that's kinda it's somewhat changing my outlook on the game now, like what could happen. I see a cat. Nope, where's the cat? Oh, you don't even need to look at the cat. The cat's right there, though. This might be the one time these people are right. Oh, boy. Shh, you 
You didn't see me. Why would I play it? Wouldn't she be able to hear it? David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break ins. What? Give me a call <sighs> soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Let's just rewind that. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe has earned a break from all this bullshit. Yeah, I did that. Oh, I... I don't want to be famous for this. Oh, boy. All right. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh. Uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Every small decision matters. It's actually making me hungry, though. Like, reality. Eggs and bacon all the way. Remember when you guys would sleep in Ugh. until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab your actual eggs help. and the bacon. I can handle eggs and bacon. I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Huh, <sighs> bacon. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chat. Wouldn't they in. both be in the fridge? I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Wouldn't they both be in the fridge? Why are they over here? The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Okay. Thanks. I thought they would have both After been in the fridge. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Yeah. Be honest, Joyce. Do you think Rachel is okay? God, I hope so. She was, is smart. And she always landed on her feet. Maybe I don't know her as well as I thought. Maybe Chloe doesn't either. Sometimes I feel like I don't know Chloe as well as I thought. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? No. What? Uh, no way. I know I was selfish when I left. I'm glad Chloe found a better friend. No, just a different one. Last time I saw you and Chloe in your pirate outfits, I knew she would never find a better friend. And when you took the rap for that joint, you proved it. Thanks. But it seems like Chloe and me were pirates a thousand years ago. And that makes me what? A century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila. A breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. I don't want to be at the table with him. I hope he's not here. Okay, this is getting weird. That freaking bird is following me. Kind of following me, I guess. Thank I don't you know. so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. 
Hey. Nothing around your fork. <laughs> I love that about games. I guess it's so hard to add animation to like eating or I don't know. You're really not going to finish that little bit. What am I supposed to do now? I guess nobody waters the plant here. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Seeing you again? Oh, okay. Ah, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. The cutscenes are so long. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Heed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Oh boy. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do I need to get into David's computer. Do this. He's gotta be hiding shit. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Oh, lovely. I'm gonna turn light I completely forgot. Oh man, I probably should have had that on the whole time. It's probably really dark in the camera. I didn't think that through at all. <laughs> oh man. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. No, I just I'm stupid. Stupid. I think it's because it was brighter out when Nothing I started playing, yet. and it just kind of went by me, <laughs> not noticing. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. All right, so let's try that. No. Nope. Worst hacker ever. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. So I get two chances, really. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Okay. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might good be day. a good password. Uh, I could try the license number for the password. I doubt that would be it, but you know what? You never know with games like this. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Maybe ID number. Uh. 
I just gotta remember also no evidence. Alright, let's try it uh let's try army. ID number. Magic eight ball says no. Such wrong. No way, Max. You totally froze top. Oh, this is gonna take a bit. Excuse me. Let's try the date. <sighs> try again. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. Maybe that. Or this. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. Try this one right here. Definitely, actually. Definitely. Uh, I think that would be personal. No, it wouldn't. Family. This one. Score! Max the Hacker strikes again. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. Oh. But why does David care? Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. That's weird, man. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad. Can we, like, turn it off, though? Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? good terms with everyone it seems like I think nice breakfast David you, you back already I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night what happened some little shit ass punks broke into the swimming pool this is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges entitled students taking over the campus do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. <sighs> Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Oh boy. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like oh he dear. spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, hey. Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Eh, I'm not signing with David. <laughs> no. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? what? Is this true, Max? Oh yes, boy. David. Why do you have these files at all? Oh I boy. find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Uh oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course, women always stick together. 
Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, oh I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. Oh, I just got awkward. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. Okay. You've hurt me and my family enough. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Okay. And... Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Okay, are we going? Alright, I'm actually going to go ahead and end this part here, so, well, maybe I should leave the house because I don't trust the saves in this game. The saves in this game are very weird. Yeah, see, there it is. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found the pictures of Rachel scene. and Frank uh, being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything. For his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. He's right there, though. Why would... Oh, man. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shit. There's a dog. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh... And... What? Chloe, Didn't... I got this. I'll be right back. Didn't even sound right, man. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. What the hell is this? Ugh, gross. What are you doing? Oh, come on. This is so creepy. Dead bird. Okay, but look at all these flyers. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna end it's this so episode sad here. That nobody will read them. Cause the save point happened, and uh, I think I got far enough in to where there will only be one more part after. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. Uh, I'm gonna get the other part out definitely tonight or tomorrow uh yeah this one was a it looks like it's a little bit longer maybe i'm wrong or not but whatever it is uh i will have this finished definitely by tomorrow so things are getting really weird in this game and it, like i said the awkward situations with the i don't know man with games like this i, I get it feels awkward that's all but what do you expect in a game that tries to get you emotionally attached to the characters? But it's a really good game so far, and I'm actually enjoying it a lot more than I expected. So, I'll end this here, though. Look out for part three coming, definitely, either tonight or tomorrow. And thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like below if you enjoyed the video, and be sure to subscribe. See you guys in the next video.